we Minoke are Prairie. What's the name? Minoke Prairie. Minoke Prairie. Minoke. So we're finally in a prairie that is in bloom. We've hiked so many prairies. Look at this orange right here. Yeah, that's nice. That is nice. We've done so many prairies that are out of season. And I was just kind of complaining a second ago. Um, and I take all my complaints out because this, this is a bit more impressive. It is hot and humid today. Ow! Yowza! I know, that guy's been annoying me too. Yeah, He's a big one. He's on your hat. Well, he's fine on my hat. He's not biting me. I like grabbed him like he's big. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for tossing him my way. Well, I don't know. I guess he switched targets. Well, you guys are kind of friends now. Well, that's good. Yeah, this is nice. What do you think, Neil? I like it. What do you like about it? I just feel very immersed <laughs> in nature as far as the eye can see. Except for that house over there. My like for prairie has changed now. So right now I'm liking prairie because what we learned from all the controlled burns is that native plants and prairie plants, the roots go down far opposed to non-native plants and that's why the local burns are prescribed burns work well because they kill all the uh, non-local and all the locals their roots are still embedded and they can come back up right. and uh, so I'm liking the prairie from what you can't see as much as from what you can see which is the root system and that root system is keeping erosion down, it's keeping water in place. It's uh, certainly helping with any type of flood conditions. Yeah, it's a lot of all good. Ryan's back taking some TikToks. But uh, yeah, this stuff is all kind of good for what we have problems with in modern society. Who knew that ma prairies could really help modern society? Look at these guys in here. These big leaves just out of nowhere and then you got patches of the whites. There's uh, something over here that looks almost like a cactus leaf but it's not yeah here's some more here it's just kind of the straight up well, it's got some sharpness to the edge all right i'm impressed color me impressed got some white purple dudes over here and then these stick things which i wish i knew a name for You know, how much do homeowners pay gardeners to create a mix of stuff where it's just out here growing naturally? Boy, well, that bug is definitely bugging me. Oh, another thing prairies help with is the heat plant. So we're cooler because we're in the prairie than we would be. Forest is obviously better, but if we were in the neighborhood over there, it would be warmer and a lot hotter downtown. Wow. You okay? Yeah, I'm just looking at all these. There's just so many varieties of things. Of course, I've let that bug catch up to me. You're an annoying one. 
All right, well, thanks for joining us in this prairie walk. Pause and take one last look around if you're into it. Ryan recommends Chain of Lakes. If you're on the north side of Chicago, is the best prairie that he has experienced in the Chicago area. I'd have to concur, there's a lot to do in the Chain of Lakes State Park. All right, see you tomorrow.